Lung cancer kills more Americans than breast, prostate, and colon cancer combined. And like other forms of cancer, the earlier it's caught, the better chance patients have to survive. Now a new device is helping doctors diagnose lung cancer in one minimally invasive procedure. Ursula Perry explains. 52-year-old Ivy Elkins is a wife, mother of two teens, and now an advocate for cancer research and treatment. Five years ago, Ivy's world turned upside down. I was completely shocked when I found out that I had lung cancer. Ivy was a non-smoker with no typical risk factors. She went to the doctor with chronic pain in her elbow. It turned out to be cancer that started in her lungs, then spread to her bones and her brain. I didn't know at that point what I know now, which is that anybody who has lungs can get lung cancer. Ivy, like many patients, had no symptoms until after the cancer had spread. This is a small nodule, but it's out near the edge of the lung. Dr. Kyle Hogarth worked closely with developers on a new system to diagnose lung cancer at an early stage. It's called the Monarch. Doctors pass a robotic bronchoscope through a patient's mouth and then secure it in one of the main branches of the lung. Using a handheld control, doctors can pass catheters through the scope into the airways. I can get out now to new regions of the lung, and because of the flexibility of this device, I can get to spots I couldn't get to before. Tiny cameras also allow doctors complete visibility while they biopsy the nodules without a patient needing invasive surgery. Ivy Elkins is being treated with targeted therapy, and that's keeping her cancer at bay. She's thrilled, though, that new cancer is now helping others at an earlier stage of the disease. The Monarch system received FDA approval in 2018 in March, but up till now, only a handful of medical centers around the country are using it. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News.